Hey guys, Chlorine King here. I want to show you quickly how to clean this Jandy True Clear Salt Cell. It's a very simple process. Uh, you can see there's some calcium build up here. The supplies you're going to need for this job is very minimal. You're going to need a bucket full of water, a bottle of acid, you're not going to use it all, and then obviously some lube. So the first thing you need to do is cut the water flow off to this. So we can go ahead and remove it. So you want to go up to your timer box or your automation system and cut the power off so it will shut the system off. And the first thing I like to do, so it's not under pressure, is bleed the filter out. That way it just helps relieve some pressure in the system. And then all you do is just turn this counterclockwise and loosen it up and it comes right out. So that's the cell, you can see it's definitely some calcium on there. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, get this taken care of. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and add our acid to the water. You always wanna add acid to water, not the other way around. I like to use a one to four mixture, so that way you don't burn off the ruthenium, but it's also strong enough to do a, a fairly quick cleaning on the cell. Uh, you don't wanna do you know, one to one or anything like that because you'll uh, prematurely erode the ruthenium, which is what makes the salt system work. So go ahead and add some acid here. And then all we do, Bring it on over here to our cell. Let me go ahead and take our cell out. Now there's an O-ring underneath here. I would go ahead and remove that. You can see that O-ring there. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove that and then put the cell in. Now we got the cell in, you can see it really bubbling. That's an indicator that the acid mixture is cleaning the cell. So now we'll go ahead and clean the pool while this soaks and then come back and rinse it off. All right, so now you can see the cell is clean as a whistle. There's not a speck of calcium anywhere in here. I went ahead and um, put the gasket in and, and pre-lubed it for the sake of the video. So all it's left to do is go ahead and put it back on. So you see the arrows on the glass there and then on the black ring as well. So that's, go ahead and put it down, do a nice little tighten there. And now all we're gonna do is turn the system back on and check for leaks. the system see if we get any leaks and if not we're good to go awesome so i don't see any leaks so that is how you clean a jandy true clear uh thank you for watching as always like and subscribe and uh stay tuned for more videos have a great day